Marvel Studios wowing audiences once again, this time with The Falcon and the Winter Soldier now streaming on Disney+. Plus. The drama leaving fans reeling as the new Captain America stares down at a traumatized crowd all while wielding his iconic shield painted with blood. A look ahead shows things are going to get more intense after last week's game-changing episode. Take a look. Symbols are nothing without the women and men that give them meaning. It doesn't have to be a war. You know what it is. And joining us right now, one of the stars of the show, Gabrielle Winloss. Winloss, thank you so much, Gabrielle, for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. It's a pleasure. You play Olivia Baker, the wife of the new Captain America. So going into the audition, did you know anything about this specific character? Uh, so, no, and it's Olivia Walker, is John Walker's wife, um, and I didn't know anything. I knew I was auditioning for Marvel, and I knew I was auditioning for the character of wife. Oh, okay. So, and well, it's interesting, too, because I read somewhere, too, that you actually ghost your family during the auditions just to be safe. What exactly took place here? So the audition came through and with any audition, you're not allowed to talk about it. It's all top secret. So I just ghosted them. My phone goes on, do not disturb or airplane <laughs> mode. And I don't speak to them about what's going on. By now they've kind of picked up that like, she's clearly doing something we can't talk about. And then eventually I rise back up and I'm like, hey, how's it going? And pretend like nothing happened. <laughs> I love it. I love, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, right? <laughs> yes, That's you have so to do what cool. you gotta do to keep the secrets. Yeah, exactly. And we were first introduced <laughs> to your character while she spoke to her husband about his new role. She was very supportive and positive. Is that something we're going to continue to see? Yes. Olivia is the strength. She's that soft-spoken strength, and she really represents what we as women do have, is the ability to be able to have a lot going on and moving around us and still keep our feet grounded. That's who Olivia is. And you're the voice of reason for your husband, but do you think he's in over his head? <laughs> <laughs> no, I think my husband can do really anything. I think it's interesting to watch somebody who's getting what he's always wanted and also the power that comes with it and what that does for a human, what that does to, makes you think about of like, where do I go? What foot do I step? But no, I don't think that he's in over his head. So what can we expect as the season progresses? You can expect for the show to just get better and better for one and to also not shy away from the hard topics. Uh, you know, Marvel really took a stance. We decided to make sure that this show is something that is relevant to today and viewers that are watching it are in store for a lot of good stuff. And, and Gabrielle, one thing too, you're a hometown girl from Ackworth. So it, it must yeah. be really wonderful knowing that you're here working from home, you know, in your home state and you didn't have to move to LA and Cali. So how does, how <laughs> was it actually getting the gigs here in state and not having to leave? Was it a challenge? It, it wasn't a challenge. It was surreal for sure. You know, when I, started to pursue my career in acting, I constantly heard, you need to move to LA, you need to move to Atlanta or to New York. And then as the film industry decided to continue to develop here in the South, it turned into, oh, congratulations, you're in the right spot at the right time. And it's not the right spot at the right time. It's all about that hard work. But I feel really proud of what Atlanta has done for the film industry and being able to be an Atlanta actress on something as big as Marvel. And what would you say to those probably actresses that are, are, are struggling and they're kind of feeling like, I don't know if I'll ever be able to make it here in state and I have to move out or what would you what kind of inspiration would you give them? I would tell them to stick to them and stay where you're at. I think I spent a lot of time trying to watch all of my friends and do all the things that they did. And when I really started to progress in my career was when I just kept my feet grounded as to who I was and showed up exactly who I was. And everything else changes around it. So I would tell them, stay here, stay in Atlanta. This is the Hollywood. It is where it needs to be and keep with who you are. That's what will get you far. Good words of encouragement coming from someone who knows well. Gabrielle Binloss, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you so much. Have a good one. You too. Continued success to you. And we would like to thank Disney Plus for help coordinating today's interview. The Falcon and the Winter Soldier is streaming now on Disney Plus.